Did you know that 3D printing with us is almost 40 years? It was first invented by Charles Hull in mid 80s. Hi everyone, welcome to our channel. And today we're gonna make a little pin that you can hang on the wall. So for that we need to open 3dp.rocks website, select images, drag and drop our image that we want to choose or just simply choose files on our computer then select outer curve because that's what we need for our frame holder then you need to go to the settings adjust maximum size to 150 thickness 3 border leave with 0 thinnest layer millimeters 0.8 vectors per pixel 4 base stand depth we don't need curve also we leave default after that we need to look at our image settings in image settings make sure it's a positive image the rest is up to you but I would leave it default and then when we are ready just simply download the file and insert that file in Cura in Cura I suggest you to use Brim so that the printout don't fall off 100% infill and of course white filament so now when we are ready with our picture let's print it out So that's what we come up with and now let's print our frame that will hold it on the wall. And here is our frame ready. I clean it up from the brim. Then we have a little hole here for the actual wires. Then we can have three places for the screws if we can drill and screw it to the wall and it will hang like this. So let's assemble these parts together and let's see how they're gonna work out. Okay, I'm gonna slide in and that's what we have. Basically, when we wanna change the picture, we slide it out. And then when we have a new picture, we just simply slide it in. For the lights, I'm gonna use this device. It has a motion sensor and it's one meter LED. You can just switch it on by simply pressing on the button. Power comes from four AAA batteries. So now let's put this all together on the wall and see how it's gonna look like. I'm gonna use double side tape since I don't have the right tools to drill the wall. So that's how it looks like with all the stickers. So I have decided to put it right here. Okay, for that we're gonna take the frame. We're gonna make sure that strip is inside and then we're gonna simply attach on top of the mirror and to the wall then i'm gonna attach remote control with the motion sensor on the side of the mirror okay then i'm gonna put as a zigzag our strip with leds so that's how it looks like i'll switch it on as i said just simply slide it in and switch it on there you go. So overall printing took me about 8 hours for the picture and 3 hours for the frame. All the links and files will be in description. Who haven't subscribed, please subscribe and have a great print.